Hi, my name is Taylor. Welcome to Taylor's Tracks Yoga. Today is yoga to boost self-image and I have just one request for you today. Do not focus on what your body looks like, but just on how you feel. You need nothing other than yourself and your mat. I'll see you there. We'll begin today sitting back on your heels, a little bit closer to the back of your mat. If this is uncomfortable to you. You can always separate your knees and your ankles and put a pillow or a block between your legs to sit on. Bring your left hands to your heart and your right hand to your belly. Go ahead and close your eyes. Focus on coming into the moment by growing the crown of your head tall towards the ceiling. Feeling your spine lengthen as your bottom settles onto your heels. Notice the subtle movement of your chest and your belly under your palms. Take a deep inhale in through your nose and a big sigh out through your mouth. One more time, just like that. Big inhale, filling up your belly. And big exhale. Coming back to your normal breath. Focusing on keeping a straight spine and coming into your body. Keeping your eyes closed so that you can focus on staying aware of your body, focusing on how you feel instead of how you look. Bring your hands down to the mat in front of you. Spread your knees wide to the edges of your mat. No worries if they're not perfect. No one's judging you right now. Walk your hands forward and bring your chest down to the mat into child's pose. Allow your arms to lengthen long. And feel your tailbone moving away in the opposite direction. Feeling a stretch in both your sides as well as your back. Take an inhale here to feel yourself grow longer. Exhale to allow yourself to melt into the mat, completely supported. Gently push into your right palm so your upper body comes off the mat and you can thread your left hand under your right armpit coming onto your left shoulder and turning your face to the right. Keeping your hips just as they are, noticing the subtle stretch in your left hand side. Just focusing on breathing into the area that you're feeling the stretch the most. Inhale your left hand back out long. Exhale to allow yourself to settle just one more breath. Big inhale. Exhale, this time threading your right hand under your left armpit. Not forcing the twist, just doing what feels good for your body right now. Yoga is never about how things look, they're always about how they feel in your body. Inhale your right arm out long again. Exhale, melt into the mat. One breath here. Inhale, push firmly into your palms, fingers spread wide and use that pressure to help pull yourself up onto all fours. Stack your shoulders over your wrists, your hips over your knees, and pull your belly button in slightly so you have a straight spine that's supported. I'm gonna to turn to face you here so you can see this better. You're gonna extend your right leg out. Your toes point forward, just like your fingers, and the entire sole of your foot is on the ground. Inhale, you're going to walk your hands over towards the left, plant your left hand, and then open your chest as you extend your right arm up and over your head.
creating a kind of curved line from the edge of your right foot all the way to your left fingertips. Continue to pull your right shoulder back gently so you open your chest and breathe into the space between your right ribs. Deep inhale here. Exhale to settle. Inhale, this time using your abs, coming up onto your fingertips. Feel yourself growing longer through your left hand side. Inhale to lengthen. Exhale, this time coming all the way up, bringing your right hands to come onto your right leg and extending your left arm all the way up and over your head. Option to look forward or to peer under your left arm. Inhale to lengthen through both sides of your body. Exhale to allow yourself to curl all the way back down, bringing your hands back under your shoulders and your right knee under your right hip. Inhale, extend your left leg out this time. Walk your hands over towards the right, planting your right hand under your right shoulder, inhaling to open your chest up towards the sky. Notice how your body feels here. Are you tense anywhere? Are you trying to look super pretty here? Your body image is never about your looks as much as people think it is. It's about how you feel and you radiate that confidence. Inhale, coming up onto your fingertips, feeling yourself expand even more. And on your next inhale, floating all the way over, left hand comes to left leg as you extend your right up and over. Feeling a juicy side stretch, that nice space between your ribs. We don't often get it too very often. And then walking your hands back down under your shoulders and bringing your left knee back in place. This time as you inhale, drop your belly, shine your chest forward into cow, allowing your spine to curl open. Exhale, pull your belly button towards the spine and push through that space between your shoulder blades. Inhale, drop on your belly. Feel your sit bones spread wide. Notice how good that feels. Exhale, allowing your head to hang heavy, pushing firmly into the mat. Once more, just like that, big inhale. Noticing what feels good. Big exhale. Come to a neutral spine. Tuck your toes under. Lift your hips up and back into downward facing dog. Notice here if you want to come into stillness immediately or maybe some movement. Are you trying to focus on getting your heels towards the ground because you've seen someone else do it and you think that's what yoga is? Well, it's not. So if you want to generously bend your knees and if that feels great for you, that's wonderful. That's your yoga practice. Allow your shoulders to fall away from your ears, your shoulder blades to come down your back, and your core is still engaged so your spine is supported. Take a deep inhale here. Exhale out through the mouth. Once more, big inhale. Exhale through your nose. Generously bend your knees, look forward, and walk your feet up towards your hand. If you have a belly that gets in the way, that's okay if you bring your feet wide. Even if you don't have much of a belly and that feels good, do it. However you need to get to this forward fold position with your knees generously bent so that your lower back is fully supported. Ooh, how does that feel on your lower back? Maybe sway a little bit. It can feel really good. Inhale, fingers come to shins. If you halfway lift, extend the crown of your head forward. Exhale, forward fold. Perhaps you need to bring your feet a little bit closer together, usually about hip width. As you bend your knees and allow yourself to roll all the way standing, thinking about vertebra by vertebra. 
Once you're in standing, bring both of your hands over your heart. Close your eyes. And just take a moment to tell yourself that you love yourself. Simply because you're you. Not focusing on how much or how little you do. Just saying, I love you. Flutter your eyes open, bring your hands to your hips. Allow your weight to come into your left foot as you push into your left big toe. Inhale, your knee comes towards the chest. Exhale, your knee comes to the side. And then place your foot either on your inner thigh, inner calf, or the tips of your toes on the mat so that your foot rests on your ankle. Wherever feels good for you, retreat. Hands can stay on your hips. They can come into prayer. Wherever you are, continue to push into your left big foot. Feel the crown of your head grow tall, allowing your confidence to radiate outwards. As you may be nailing this, and if you're feeling a little wobbly today, our confidence is wobbly some days too. It's just a reflection of life. Perhaps you extend your arms all the way up to grow even taller. Pushing firmly into your left leg with your right foot. Last inhale. Exhale, hands to hips, knee comes forward, and then allow your foot to come down. Maybe you need to shake out that left leg a little bit. Do what feels good for you always. So this time, allow your weight to come to the right foot. Inhale, your left knee up. Exhale, allow it to come to the side. And then placing your foot on your inner thigh, calf, or ankle. Maybe it feels different on this side. Just notice bringing your hands to prayer on your hips, maybe even reverse prayer behind your back to help open your chest, or extending them up to the sky once again. This is your practice. Do what feels good, not what you think looks good. We're not posing for an Instagram picture here, <laughs> but we are standing tall. Our cores are engaged. And we're simply doing our best that we can for today. Last inhale. Exhale, hands come to your hips, knee comes forward, and you allow your left foot to come down to the mat. Inhale your hands all the way up to the sky, feeling yourself fully expand from your toes on the mat to your fingers. Hands come through heart center as you forward fold, fingertips back to the mat. Inhale, halfway lift, long spine, and exhale, forward fold. Plank your palms, step back into a plank. We're just here for two breaths, pushing between that space between your shoulder blades, just like we did in cat. Push your heels backwards towards an imaginary wall, deep inhale. Exhale to hold. Once more, big inhale. Exhale, allow your knees to come down to the mat. Untuck your toes and allow your bum to come to sit back on your heels. Place your left hand on your heart, your right on your belly, and close your eyes. Coming back to exactly where we started. Reflect on how you felt through that practice. Did it feel good for your body? Or did you catch yourself forcing yourself into the prettiest version, or the version of a pose that you think looks best? If you did, that's perfectly okay. Know that this practice is available for you to do at any time. Take a deep inhale in through your nose and a big sigh out, allowing yourself to fully relax. Stay here 
holding yourself for as long as you need. Until you feel comfortable with yourself for today. And when you're ready, bring your hands into prayer position. Bow your forehead so your fingertips meet your third eye. And thank yourself for showing up today, for doing this act of self-love for your mind, body, and your soul. Bring your head up and your prayer hands to your third eye. The divine light in me honors the divine light in you. Together, we bow forward. Thank you so much for sharing your energy with me today. I hope you feel a little bit more comfortable in your body, no matter if you are feeling a little bit wobbly today or not. Like I said, this practice is always here for you to return to, and I have a new video out every Thursday. So if you love this and want more on body image, confidence, feeling great, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you again soon. Have a good one.